Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. Last time we were killed by this jerk! So, naturally, this time, we are going to make sure that doesn't happen. Uh, again. Where the, where the hell is it? There it is. The solution is actually a very simple one. Uh, if we magic hammer it twice, it will not be able to hit us with its bullshit. Um, again, it's right at the top. With its bullshit attack. Uh, having said that, oh hey, you actually have trying. Having said that, I want to kill the arms now. I've done the magic hammer thing. Now I need to kill the arms. I would, I want to kill them before I do this, because it is actually weak against electricity. I double checked. I died. It killed me once. I think that's fair. Um. So Gigas. So. Death Gigas would actually not be a terrible choice against it. Uh, however, I really do want to make sure his arms are gone first. Simply because, uh, well... Simply because I don't want it to pick me up. It picking up Cloud is what killed me as least as much as Lapis Beam did. So, you know, let's, let's not have a repeat. What did I just say? Me I don't know if this will hit Cloud or not. <laughs> well, I guess we'll find out. Uh... Well, Cloud is not in its arm, so I can only assume that means it that Cloud is not going to get hit by Neo Bahamut. He, however, he might be hit by Trine. It's hard to say. I, I guess we'll see in a minute. Although, ideally, one of the arms would just be, you know, perfect. Uh... That's not the other- oh! The other arm's gone now. Great! Okay, uh, you know, I should actually use- wait. Time for DEATH GIGAS! And also, cure. This is one of the few opportunities where this is actually a good idea. Uh... Hmm. I suppose I could do this as well, but it feels somewhat unnecessary at this point. It should no longer... Yeah! It can no longer use lap speed if its arms are gone. I don't really need the extra defense now. I can pretty much just let Vincent... Death Gigas! Kick its ass! Yeah, you can see right there. Skill power used up. That's because it's trying to spam lap speed now. Th that asshole. I wonder if I can mimic Vincent's Limit Break attacks. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to try. Giga Dunk! Did it work? Could not mimic. Okay, so you actually... Well, he did the Limit Break animation though. So I wonder if that would work on other Limit Breaks. Clearly he cannot mimic Death Deus. But... That does not necessarily mean he cannot mimic other limit breaks. <laughs> anyway, we did it! Yay! And we got God's Hand, which I believe is a Weave On for Tifa. However, the submarine is gone. Well, we better get to it. Uh, but first, we have boxes to open, like the Battle Trumpet, which I don't actually care about. But there's also two more boxes that I do, in fact, care about, uh, if I can find them. Because we cannot come back down here once we're gone. So, hmm. Well, there's a thing there, so... Let's see... Oh yeah, right here. 
And over there, we got the Scimitar! Which is really the most important one, I think. But also, the Leviathan Scales, which are a key item. Um, which I'll talk about those Leviathan Scales probably in a couple of episodes, when we actually use them. Uh, that Scimitar, though. Uh, what? I, I thought that was a weapon for Cloud. Oh, it's a weapon for Sid. Go figure. In any case, uh, that is a triple AP growth weapon. There's only, like, a couple of those in the whole game. So, it is pretty damn important. Also, I really thought it was a weapon for Cloud, so, you know, go figure. Uh, anyway. Okay, so I figured out you can steal 8-inch cannons from these, and not the armor that I thought, but they sometimes drop chinrabettas, so I'm, I'm thinking I may have just gotten my notes confused and thought they had something that they did not. Uh, either that, or there's some other enemy you can steal Shinra Alphas from, if those are even a thing, because I'm honestly not sure if Shinra Alphas are a thing at, or not at this point. And I certainly don't need Shinra Bettas. You see? Drop a Shinra Betta. Anyway. Hello. Why, hello there. Time to die. Because the vampire will kill you. Oh, well, I guess I just killed you. But the vampire will probably kill you. No, I guess that's Yuffie. Okay, the vampire didn't actually kill any of you. But I assure you that is not very abnormal. <gasps> I have Mog! I'm gonna need to try that out. Although, I still think steel may legitimately be better. Uh, maybe not. You sure you want to do that? Okay, I guess you do. Well, do it yourself. There's the vampire I know and love. Yeah, Mug just straight up replaced steel. Actually, probably worse than steel. Well, may well, maybe. I don't know, it's debatable. I do feel like if they're gonna give me a mug command, it really may as well just replace the attack command, as in Final Fantasy VI. Er, sorry, not Final Fantasy VI, Final Fantasy VIII. Because this is completely redundant with this. I mean, I guess I'll eventually get another s I guess if I'm really worried about it, I can just buy another steel. Anyway, I'm still excited about having Mug. Now, there's a save point here I notice. I feel it is very essential to save right now. Not only because of my recent technical difficulties, but also because I'm about to do a mini game where my success is actually pretty freaking important. Um. So yeah, hi guys! No, no, this is terrible! I mean, I wouldn't want to die either. Alright then, make this your first victory! Do the victory dance! <laughs> it's these guys, man, they're great. Not so much their, not so much their Sarge, but, uh, yeah, no. I don't have an enemy to fight you guys. I like you too much. Uh, what? Cloud. Cloud, what are you doing? No, you the bee! Stop! You're even worse than Cloud! Why did I think bringing these two was into a submarine was a good idea? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I would too with her at the wheel. I mean, you're really the only option here. Hmm. Wait, what? Th <laughs> Thank 
thank you! I'm so happy to be a hostage! I mean, you would have definitely died. So... Uh... Mm hmm... Wait... Yuffie's actually panicking more than Cloud. Damn it, Yuffie! Uh, read the manual. Okay, speed up. Fire. Speed down. What does the confirm button do? Presently on the ocean floor near Juan, a red leader submarine, which is the one we ha which incidentally is the one we have to sink. Uh, carrying huge materials, being escorted by co covert Shinra submarine units. Furthermore, it is being confirmed that several mines have been dispersed onto the ocean floor. The ocean floor can be monitored with the radar screen. Enemy subs can only be detected within the sonar area. Get in front of the detected enemy sub and lock on! Press switch to fire the torpedo! The mines are found in the radar screen at the top of the indicators. The mines inflict great damage. Be careful. Sink the red sub. The time limit, I think, is pretty generous on this. But, even so, like, I'll, I'll have to re- it is pretty important to actually be successful here, otherwise we would lose a lot of shit. Uh, so... Fire! Fire! How do I go down? There we go. Slow down! No! Yep, that was easy. It starts, like, literally right in front of you, so it's actually not that hard. Uh, actually, it's e that was easier than I thought it would be, if I'm being honest. I mean, I knew it started in your general vicinity, but I didn't expect it to start literally right on top of me. Uh, in any case. We did it! Yay! Now we need to recover it. Although, I gotta say... If you were just going to... S it isn't, isn't actually doing anyone any good on the bottom of the ocean. Like, the whole point of stealing this stuff from Shinra is so that we can use it to save the planet? Uh, because as, as ill-conceived as their plan is, it's probably not going to make things worse. Hmm... This is Shinra number two. Everything normal. Return to Juan. Uh, what? Oh, I guess that's still the Niflheim materia. Hmm. Okay, forget about the huge materia. We need to go get the other huge materia. Hey. Uh, I'm so glad I brought you with me, Yuffie. Okay, so there's the underwater reactor, there's Juon, there's our chocobo, and airship. And there's the damn phone. <sighs> if that had happened 30 seconds later, it would have been perfect, because I am about to stop off here. We have a- we should rush into Zua, and by the way, where the- where did the cannon go? Um, but no, we have a l whole lot of shit we can do with this submarine now. So we're gonna do some of it! Uh, next time. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VII, and have a great day. Bye!